Hello again, guys, and my name is Gregory Nable, and I'm going to do like a quick video because I'm like tired right now. But this is a theory I thought that was kind of cool. Well, the theory is is um, Red, the character that you play of in the original Pokemon. Red the trainer is a uh, Mac from Foster Tom Imaginary Friends. I found it. I want to explain how it adds up first. Well, basically, Mac or Max, whatever his name is, I believe it's Mac. I don't know. Don't mind my TV. Mac is like six, I believe, six or seven around that age. And uh, Red, the Pokemon trainer in the original Pokemon game, he's somewhere like in his teenage years. He could be about 16, 17, or 18, or even 19, even 20. But that's how it adds up. What, what I don't get that don't, does it add up is what time, what time zone, or not time zone, what time of the year did Foster Home's Imaginary Friends take place in? It's possibly, it's possible it could have took place in the 80s, I believe. It could have took place in the 80s. I think it took place in 1984, I believe or not. And, uh, I believe Mike was born in 1980. But what don't make sense though is that little time gap. That's only four years. Or unless Mike was born in 1978. Or I could have mistaken that 1884 year. Maybe not 1986, I believe. Either one of those years. But anyway, the the first Pokemon game. I'm trying to remember when it came out. I believe. I believe 1996. I believe when it came out. That makes a little bit of sense. I'm gonna think about it. I can foster some imaginary friends, Mac or, or AK Red. He was a little kid that had an imaginary friend and had a big brother that was bullying him. And then, as he grew up, he must have got rid of his imaginary friend Blue at some point. And this would explain why he's Red's always like so mysterious and don't talk that much. That would explain that perfectly. I'm going to think about this theory some more and I'm going to see what else I got. I'll see y'all later.